A couple Atlanta talents are bringing their shows to a city near you this summer. Let's kick it off with Gunna Wanna, who announced that he is doing a tour. How about Flo Millie being accompanied with Gunna on a tour that's called the Bittersweet Tour? This is a North America tour, uh, mostly 2000 C venues for Gunna Wanna, who, as many of you know, emerged back into the limelight in 2023 after he agreed to a plea deal at the end of 2022. Now Gunna is headed on the road, and I'm I'm hearing that Gunna's going to drop another project too before he goes on the road, uh, coming off the back of his successful album that he had last year. Y'all let me know, is that something y'all will be into? He will not be the only one on the road, as 21 Savage has announced the American Dream Tour with J.I.D., Nardo Wick, Who Won't Smoke With Me, and 21 Lil' Harold. They are also heading to a city near you in the states uh man they're all over the place 21 savage probably got what 30 dates on his tour he fresh off of his tour with drizzy drake that boy savage ain't wasting no time getting back to the skrilla he is headed on the road so y'all let me know of those two tours which one would you rather see all right now i think 2024 if you are an artist that stands right around where Ghana and 21 Savage stand in the game. These are obviously popping entities with huge fan bases on their own. I think this is probably the best year to get on the road because if you're looking at the landscape of music, just like last year where you had the big fish on the road, Beyonce, Taylor Swift, and at the end, Drake, I don't think you're going to want to get on the tour scene in 2025. Because, you know, it, it, it costs to go see Gunna and 21 Savage. You know, um, if, if there's a Beyonce fan out there, if there's a Taylor Swift fan out there, you expect those artists to be back on the road in 2025 because they're dropping music in 2024. And no, when you're at that level, you do not drop music unless a tour is on your mind. Somebody might say, uh, I got $250. I could give Savage or Gunna $100. But I could go see Beyonce, Taylor Swift, or we'll see what happens with somebody like Drake or, or J. Cole or Kendrick. I think this is probably the best year to get your ass on the road. That's what I'm telling y'all. I think uh, 21 Savage has been incredible with his business. I don't know who the hell is ba back in Gunner right now, but ever since he's come home, Kevin Lyles and company, they've been doing exceptional business. Let me know what are you more excited or who are you more excited to see? I see Gunner's going to finish his Atlanta tour uh, doing an arena and stay far marina that, that'll be interesting to see let me know between savage or Ghana, who do you plan on seeing this summer as the rappers are taken to the stages time love and support is what you boy would never take for granted salute i'm out i want to salute you homie you know for for building your own thing and doing your own thing why build theirs when i believe i can build my own you've already done it or i wouldn't be here i'm already the only elite sports and music journalist in the game today my goal is simple to be the best there's ever been. So, make sure you subscribe and follow the journey. It truly means everything to me. I tell stories, I talk music, I cover sports, I am culture, I am Pharaoh.